he and the first lady decided uh, whether Baron will come back? Oh, that's a personal decision. I don't know what Baron's school has decided, and I certainly don't know what the first couple has decided with respect to their teenage son, who I believe is entering high school this year. Um, I, I, I have two kids in Maryland also in private schools, and I think we're just waiting to see what those schools say. So far, we're told we're going back in a school not far away from his, um, the end of August, and uh, we're, we're waiting to see if that happens. And I, I think that we also recognize that not all school districts are the same. I mean, not all the hot spots are the same. So there is no one size fits all, except to say that what we do know about kids is that on balance, they thrive better when they're in a structured, safe environment like our schools, our school days. We certainly know the statistics where the mental health services, the child abuse reporting, the meal delivery, the ability to interact with an adult eyeball to eyeball, and then of course to get a quality education, um, all are done better in person in the classroom or outside. I think some of these places are getting, I was with Secretary DeVos in my office last night for quite a while talking about some of the best practices we're hearing from around the country. Um, some folks are saying, let's just do more outside instruction, get the kids with nature. Also, you know, maybe three days on, two days off. Um, but these parents need certainty also.